Hi, and welcome to The Beatery. My name is Lori, and I'm the designer here at The Beatery. We'd like to invite you in to watch a few of our brand new how-to videos. We'll be featuring some new products and some old favorites, too. Today, we will be working with The Beatery's Handy Loom, which comes with a pick tool, 600 latex-free bands, 24 C-clips, and directions. We also offer our Mega Kit Loom Collection. This collection comes with one handy loom, two wonder looms, two pick tools, 100 pony beads, 1,350 latex free bands, 48 C clips, 15 pendants, one sticker set, and directions. You will need the following items 33 line bands, reserve two bands for finishing your bracelet, 30 purple bands, and 30 turquoise bands one handy loom, and one pick tool. Let's begin by placing the first band on the handy loom. Take one line band and stretch the band on all four pegs. With the pick tool, hook the line band and remove it from one peg. Twist the band and replace it back on the peg. Repeat twisting the band on all the other three pegs. Add one purple band above the lime band, and then one turquoise band above the purple band. You will need to push your bands down on the pegs to make room for the next band added. Gently push with the side of your pick tool to reposition the bands. This will be the color sequence for this bracelet, lime, purple, and turquoise. Remember, there should always be three bands on the pegs before looping. Take your pick tool, go into the channel, lift the bottom band, in this case is lime, up and over the peg. Repeat this on the three remaining pegs. Add one new band to all four pegs. It will be lime. You will know which band color is next by the color band you have just finished looping over the pegs. Repeat the looping steps until you have used all of the bands. Remember to reserve those two lime bands for finishing your bracelet. After all the bands have been used, there will be two bands left on the loom pegs. Lift the bottom band up and over the pegs until there is only one band left on all pegs. Hook the one band, lift up and over the peg and place it on the next peg counterclockwise to the pin. Rotate the handy loom 180 degrees. Lift the next band up and over the peg and attach it to the next peg. Now you should have two pegs across from one another 
that have two bands each on it. Add the one remaining lime band to the two pegs. Now lift both bottom bands up and over the peg. Lift one at a time the last two bands left on both pegs, keeping both loops on the pick tool. Pull the bracelet gently out of the handy loom. Attach one C-clip to the two loops on your pick tool. Next, at the beginning side of the bracelet, slide the pick tool under and through the line bands. With the hook of the pick tool exposed, pull the last line band halfway through to form two loops on either side. Before attaching the loops to the C-clip, give the bracelet a gentle pull and stretch to form the quadrifish pattern. Attach the two loops to the C-clip, and now you're finished. I hope you've enjoyed this project and will tune in for more fun beatery projects to come.